Good morning, friends. Coach Campbell here. It is May 12th, 2020. Let's begin in prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. God, let me play well but fairly. Let competition make me strong but never hostile. Forbid me to rejoice in the adversity of others. See me not when I am cheered, but when I bend down to help my opponent up. If I know victory, allow me to be happy. If I am denied, keep me from envy. Remind me that sports are just games. Help me to learn something that matters once the game is over. And if through athletics I set an example, let it be a good one. Amen. And Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Friends, there is something that I want to talk to you about that I just realized in the last couple of days, maybe a little secret that we probably should have shared with you sooner, parents. And that is, even for us teachers, the last couple of weeks of school are hard. So if you're noticing an uptick in the meltdowns, an uptick in the, I don't want to do this anymore, I'm tired of doing my homework, I, I don't want to go to school today, that's normal. Like, I think we kind of forget that, you know, there's a lot more field trips at the end of the year and, and um, different kinds of activities because it's, it's hard to keep the kids focused. They know that summer's approaching. We have uh, two and a half weeks of schoolwork, of serious schoolwork still ahead of us. And for us teachers, like during the school year, it's hard. It's hard to rein them in. The weather's gorgeous. The kids want to be outside playing. So be patient with yourself. Be patient with your kids. Um, it's, it's something we experience as teachers every year and we're ready for it. You guys may not be cause, cause we've dealt with that and, and we, we know we need to prepare different things a little bit differently. So, um, be patient with yourself, be patient with your kids. Uh, we're doing some different kind of activities here. We color, working on coloring, beautiful colored pencils, fun coloring pages. When people get stressed out, we find new activities to do. There's a lot of reading going on in the Campbell household. Um, they may be tired of schoolwork, but their, their adventure storybook kind of still uh, calls to them. So while we may not be getting as much ELA done, we're getting a lot of reading done. And, and those balance each other out a little bit. So do your best. Like Find what works for your family. Do your best you can with your schoolwork and realize that the last couple of weeks of school, even when things are typical, are still kind of challenging for, for teachers. Uh, the kids are ready for summer. They're ready to play outside. So you have the opportunity to make the most of that, uh, being at home. And I hope you see that. I know that I'm praying for you. Know that it's not easy anywhere. It's, everybody is um, having their own challenges and, and ready to be done with school. So... I'm praying for you. I'm here for you. You can do this. We only have a couple weeks left. You've got it. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Love you.